Hello everyone, I am Dr. Swapna Horgudu and we are discussing chapter 2 that is advertising and pricing. Now see, meaning and importance of pricing related laws. The price regulation refers to the policy of setting prices by government agency and a regulatory authority. Under this, the policy minimum and maximum prices may be set. As per the price regulation, also includes the guidelines which specify the magnitude by which prices can increase. Around the world, businesses operate within a certain system of laws in setting prices for product and services. The prices laws also help prevent unethical pricing practices. The price control policy is mainly aimed at controlling inflation to give a support to the national economy. Let us discuss the laws related to price, payment, consumers, rights, search, change payment regulations. The first is a Consumer Protection Act 1986. As per the Consumer Protection Act 1986 is a social this is a social regulation intended to protect consumers from the exploitation. Thanks to this law, the people can get a speedy and the inexpensive redressal of their grievances and are in a position to declare the sellers be aware. Whereas the previously they were at the receiving aid. This act is protecting the rights of the consumers. Drug Price Control Order 1995 As per this, an order issued by the government under Section 3 of the Essential Commodities Act 1955 the order provides the list of price control drug drugs, the procedures for fixation of a drug prices, method of implementation of prices fixed by the government and the penalties for the contraventions of provisions. The third is the Essential Commodities Act 1955. The Essential Commodities Act was enacted in 1955, has since been used by the government to regulate the production, supply and distribution of a whole host of commodities that it declares essential to make them available to, available to consumers at a fair prices. If the center finds that a certain commodity is in short supply and its price is speckling, it can notify a stock holding limits on it for a specified period. Hence, the price is controlled the price of the essential products are controlled by the government. As per this law, black marketing is completely prohibited. Now see the fifth one, it's a competition act 2002. Now, it's a replaced as the Monopolies and the Restrictive Trade Practices Act 1969. It is replaced.
for this. The main objectives of the Competition Act 2002 are to provide the framework for the establishment of the Competition Commission, to prevent monopolies and to promote competition in the market, to protect the freedom of trade for the practicing individuals and entities in the market and to protect the interest of the consumer. Some are the features of the Competition Act 2002 that is anti-competitive agreements, abuse of dominant position and the Competition Commission of India. It is a statutory body that has the power to govern and enforce the Competition Act including penalties. Thank you very much.